Thanks, guys, Ed. First off, congrats on the Thank win. You. This one being the fourth straight WCC title for the Cougars. What's special about this team? Well, it, it's a good group of guys who just worked together, sacrificed a lot, worked really hard over the summertime, and have have some uh, big, audacious goals as they uh, go into the season. And this was one of them, certainly, to win the conference meet, especially when you're hosting it here on this beautiful course at home. Uh, love the fact that we had some great competition out there, certainly Portland. Portland is uh, ranked number three in the country, and they brought their top guy here today, and he showed what they're capable of doing, but I think my guys ran the rate, kind of race that they wanted to do, uh, kind of a chill and kill, and I was impressed by the way that they were able to kind of ratchet the pace up every 2K. Um, so a good test of fitness for us today, and from here we go on to the regionals and nationals. How much do you think that home field advantage, the fans, the altitude, everything that goes in with that helped out today? Oh, oh, that's always helped helpful. Out today. There's no we doubt. Are going I'm to sure, uh, you know, we only get to come up in to altitude uh, about every nine or ten sports. years, so we want to take advantage of that. Um, but I think, like you know what, I think ultimately um, the fitness carries the day. We saw with the, the Portland runner who ended up winning today. He's not an altitude trained guy, but obviously was the fittest guy today. So. Uh, so I think fitness, as long as you run a controlled race, don't go out too crazy early on at altitude. We have You're it's still going to break down kind of according to what you would think. But, but we like the fact the that we got a lot of fans out here, a lot of the, uh, family. That's the main thing. Line immediately. got opportunities to see their, the guys and the, the women run at home. And with the West Coast Mary's Conference coaches, Championships, you guys being two, Portland to the finish and Freak and Zaga coming up there towards the end of the top 25. What emphasis do you put on your program for this event? Well, obviously this is one of the, there are two main meets we want to do well at. One is the conference championship and the other is the national championship. And so the guys know we're in championship uh, portion of the season right now. And so we do workouts accordingly. Um, you know, we didn't really back down a lot this week as we've done maybe in past ones because we knew we maybe had a bit of an advantage with the altitude. Uh, but we still, you know, got some really good work in. And I think this was a nice test of fitness for us. And we'll build on this, hopefully take some confidence out of this. and. Uh, do some little tweaks going into the uh, first round of the NCAAs, which is a regional meet, and then the national championships on November 17th. Great, congrats, Ed. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you. Talk to you guys. Yep.